Hello everyone, welcome to another tutorial with EC QuickBooks Training. Today I wanted to show you how you can prepare for 1099s on QuickBooks Online. So let's get started. The 1099, you can access it in the Vendor Center. And you can go to where it says Prepare 1099s. Now this button is available only if you have the Plus subscription with QuickBooks. So once we go into this um, 1099 preparation, QuickBooks is going to um, open up a wizard where it's going to walk us through the process of preparing for 1099s. So let's go through the process of preparing our 1099s. And we have five steps in this wizard. So let's see here. We have to have a tax ID. And let's click Next. Here we can select the accounts that we need to have in Box 7 for non-employee compensation. And usually um, you can select multiple, like if you have your accounting, uh, your bookkeeping, um, uh, let's see, your subcontractors, let's see what they have under cost of goods here. Um, I'm just going to select labor or let's see what they have. Oh, they don't have sub. What's their cost of goods? Hmm. I don't see any cost of goods. Oh, they have here cost of goods, but we could put accounting cost of goods. Let's see what it gives us. And here is one person. We just verify if everything looks good. We hit next. And because there's nobody in the account, um, within the accounts that I chose, it's not bringing anything up. But this would be the fourth step. And then you can print your information sheet where it's going to show you all the subcontractors um, or independent contractors that require a 1099 if it's been set up, if they've been set up in their vendor center. So the fifth step is just to um, get the actual forms ready and QuickBooks does offer to do it for you, but then you can also do it yourself by clicking I'll file myself. And then it takes you to another wizard and the process of printing on the actual 1099 forms. That's what I wanted to show you today on how to prepare 1099s. Please subscribe to my channel for more tips and tricks and how-tos, and I will see you on the next one.